the infamous Boleskin House. interesting ghost, or whatever you want to call it, that inhabit the place, is one of uh, a chap called Simon Lord Lovett, who was chief of the Fraser clan at the time of the uh, Jacobite rebellion, in, or whenever it was, the Battle of Culloden anyway, which most people will have heard about. He uh, was finally beheaded for treason in London, in the Tower of London, and his head, at the time of his execution, was supposed to have fallen into a basket and in fact didn't it rolled off across the floor and the story goes that at the time of his death that he was thinking of himself in the heart of the highland which we are just about in the geographical dead center of the highlands right here and his head still rolls up and down the corridor outside this room here um, and can be heard at night i've heard it myself several times Crowley, by his own preference, liked to be called the Great Beast. Looking out over the grounds of Boleskine House, past the graveyard, one cannot help but wonder if he saw himself as a kind of alter ego to that Great Beast under the black water. In his strange life, might he not have communed with the monster itself, as he claimed to do so often with the raised souls of the dead hovering over the silent stones of the ancient crypts?